646 on your Monday morning. Las Vegas Mayor Carolyn Goodman back with us again this morning. How are you? I couldn't be better. I just am <laughs> so, so full of energy and so lucky. Which, and, and and, it's and so, so good to lucky see you. to have another term. You know, you've got me for another four years. I know. We're, now we're, we're stuck <laughs> together now. What can we do? <laughs> now, we spoke last week. We did a story. We spoke about uh, your third term and, of course, your battle with breast cancer. Uh, let's talk a little bit about, I guess, where things stand right now and how you're feeling. I feel great. We're full speed ahead. I've got a couple of more issues I have to take care of, but everything's fabulous. I'm so excited, and the people are so warm and, and gracious to me. I can't tell you. I'm very lucky. I, I did ask you this. I don't know if I put it in the story last week, but just what was it like to walk back into City Hall for the first time as a mayor again when with this health stuff is kind of behind you? It's called balloons without <laughs> helium. <laughs> without helium. <laughs> um, just exciting and I think everybody that at least works in my office that knows they have four more years was absolutely thrilled. So we're starting now, your third, you're starting your third and final term. What are some of the goals for the next four years? Well, you know, the medical district's paramount, but we have so much economic development. In fact, this week we're opening or having the groundbreaking on Southern Land, a 300-unit complex, I think $62 million complex. We're this building our ex symphony park we've got expo coming online that's a hundred million dollar convention facility we've got new garages we got circa we've got uh, boyd going up i mean i can't tell you who wants to sleep <laughs> <laughs> you mentioned earlier also uh, the medical district um, project neon is just about to wrap up obviously if you live in that area you know <laughs> kind of the arduous journey that was um what with, with the construction finishing up there, how do you see the medical district expanding and, and growing moving forward? Well, you know, the RTC is really paramount in that, trying to figure out the traffic flow of public transportation, whether we're going to do light rail, what are we doing, and I sit on that committee. But I think it's connecting it all, and when you look at the fabulous job Project NEON has done with opening up industrial and having all that entry into the heart of the city. That's where 1595 come together. The core of the city definitely is the core of the city. It will have a huge impact on the success of the medical district, which we expect to be over a billion dollars worth of economic impact, but also employing a probably a new 20,000 people in the heart of it. So you mentioned uh, the Symphony Park, uh, that groundbreaking, and one of the concerns is getting more people to, to maybe live downtown in addition to all the developments happening on Fremont Street. What are some other things that are about to, to sort of happen in the downtown area that uh, you can, we're looking forward to? Well, you go into the Arts District. I mean, that's one of my favorites. You know, we've landscaped and streetscaped all of Main Street. It's one way, as is commerce. But the energy and with the little lights above, the it, lights, there's yeah. just, oh my gosh, the energy there, especially first Friday, but almost every weekend, and especially for those who are living downtown, and we see an awful lot of uh, development going on. We've got Fremont 9. We have another project planned for Symphony Park, and it's just, it's a very, very exciting time for everyone. Well, excited that you're here for another term and you're feeling thank well you. as well. That's oh, the most yes. important thing. Yes. Mayor Goodman, thank, thank you. you. Thank you for joining Thanks, us this morning. Sean. If you have a question for the mayors here in Southern Nevada, just go to lasvegasnow.com. You can click on the banner that says Monday mornings with the mayor. In three minutes, more news. This is Good Day. Good morning.